I'm Neha Chaudhary. Uh, I'm an instructor in electrical engineering department in South Dakota School of Mines. This semester I taught a foundation course for electrical engineer and other than that I teach electrical engineers to non-majors which we call non-believers and I try to make them believe that electrical engineering is not that bad. So my father had this habit that whatever broke in our house he has to open it first. I think that's what inspired me and he could never fix it. For example if our TV is broke he has to open it. He has no idea what he's doing but he will open it. So all he knew that red should match with red, black should match with black. For me it was more fun uh, doing what my dad was doing, even though he didn't know what he was doing. And then I used to open my younger sister's uh, toys, uh, what remote control toys she had. And I used to do the same, I didn't know what I was doing but I needed to open it. But in, in a nutshell why I decided to become an engineer because I was really interested in making and breaking stuff. Nowadays, if you're an engineer, you just don't have to be good in, in, in like technical. You have to have empathy, you have to have human value, you have to have ethics. And I think everybody can be agreed on that, that women has more empathy or more soft skill than men. You have to be a good communicator, you have to be uh, good towards people, you have to be good working with people. And in my own experience, like women, like they are more comfortable working in a team and uh, working with each and everyone. But getting those kind of soft skills, which, which industry actually want, is very important. So when they open a post, it's not the post for men, it's for an engineer. So no, nobody says you're a man engineer or woman engineer, you are an engineer. That's the problem with debts. They will never ask you, they need your help. 